Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we will continue our journey painting Eve from the game Stellar Blade by painting her main body. Keep in mind that her arms and sword will be painted in another video. Without further ado, let's get to painting! We will start with Aldari Emerald and paint the green part of her bodysuit. This step includes both the upper and lower body. Disclaimer that the Eldari Emerald on camera does not look as green and vibrant as in real life. Continuing on with Warpstone Glow on the right little elevated area of the bodysuit as well as the straps. Do your best to avoid painting on the contrast we used in the previous step as it will be kind of hard to fix. Next we will mix 1 to 1 Abaddon Black and German Grey. With the mix, we will paint the area across the strap which is next to the contrast as well as the strap holders. Keep in mind there are places to paint in the back of the model which are not demonstrated. With the use of pure Rubidon Black, we will paint the metals in the lower belly. Without changing color, meaning we'll stay with Abaddon Black, we will paint the center of all straps that lead to Eve's back. If any mistake occurs, fix it as soon as possible applying the respective color. We will continue with Celestro Grey on the half of the lower bodysuit that is not painted with Aldari Emerald. In addition, we will paint the lower sides of the upper part. Subsequently, we will use Corax White and paint the chest area and the remaining halves of the sides of the upper body. In addition to that, we will paint the fine line between the two halves on the lower body. As all places have adjacent areas with colors, in the case of mistakes, fix by applying the respective color. Using any pure white, for example scale colors white or white scar. We will paint the center of all buttons on Eve's bodysuit. We'll also paint any other areas that need to be a bright color due to lighting. This includes areas on her backside as well. Shaking our tesseract glow extremely well and without diluting it, we will cover all areas that we just painted white. Now we will move to the skin. We will apply Cadian Flesh Tone directly on the white primer. If you don't feel comfortable doing it, you can paint the skin first with white or light grey and then apply Cadian. As the skin is drying, we will mix some Kisla Flesh to our Cadian Flesh Tone in a consistency of 1 to 1. With said mix, we will add highlights on the skin in the areas like shoulders and the pretty bone. Afterwards, we will add details on the skin with pure Kizla Flesh. For the upper body, one final step remains, and it contains Black Templar and the choker Eva wears on her neck. We will shortly return to Abaddon Black in order to paint the shoe bottoms. Then, we'll go back to Corax White and using the belly of the brush, we will paint the engraving on the side and behind of Eve. For the penultimate step of the main body, we will paint the other small engraving Eve has on her left thigh with German Grey. Finally, in order to give the feeling of light reflection on the bodysuit, we will cover all areas previously painted with Aldari Emerald with gloss varnish. We cannot consider the body finish if we don't paint her tie and cape. For the tie, paint the whole piece with Corax White in order to give it a good base for future steps. Using Warpstone Glow, we will paint all the raised details on the tie. The main body of the tie will be painted with Abaddon Black. Be careful not to overpaint the area surrounding it. Going back to Warpstone Glow, we shall paint all details on the tie body. 
then we will mix one to one Corax white and any pure white, for example, white scar. With the mix, we will add details on the areas around the tie. Subsequently, take the pure white you used and add details to the highlights. For the cave, we will use Drakenhof Nightshade to paint the flaps. The rest of the cave will not be demonstrated as I have already shown how to paint these straps and surrounded area earlier in this video. The result should look like this. If you liked this video or found it useful and inspirational, don't forget to hit the like button and smash the subscribe. Any interaction helps the channel to grow. All colors used in this video are on your screen now. I was Miniature Ursus, thank you for watching and I will see you on the next one.